Hello, you are watching Indian News. This is Atnakar with English Bulletin. The news in details considering the rapid rise in the number of coronavirus cases in the city the district administration has converted five more quarantine centers and one private hotel into covid care center with this the number of beds in seven covid care center has increased to more than 2000 with the increasing number of patients the administration has changed mla hostel quarantine center into covid care center later covid care center was started in hengna base chalita mega hospital after the 370 beds of MLA Hostel Covid Care Center became full. But on the very first day, the 40 beds of Shalit Thai Mega Hospital were also full. Due to the increasing number of asymptomatic patients, the situation has arisen to admit patients into ICU and HDU, that is High Dependency Unit of Mayo and GMCH Covid Hospital. Munde said we have capacity in government hospitals including three major institutions namely IG GMC GMCH and AIMS most private hospitals will be working as a dedicated covid healthcare or dch in the days to come five more hospitals will be activated he said antigen test will be carried out on those showing symptoms of influenza like illness and severe acute respiratory infections Private hospitals are being monitored to ensure patients are not overcharged Munde said The tug of war between the narco civic chief and corporators is now a talk of the town it has got a new turn when Maharashtra chief minister Uddhav Thackeray has strongly supported Tukaram Munde Chief Minister on Sunday stated that the everyone should stand firmly behind Monday. CM stated that Tukaram Monde is a disciplined officer. The tussle between him and the NMC administration is known to the entire state. Monde has acted in a public interest. An officer can act strictly for the welfare of the public and there is nothing wrong in doing so. A protest was organized on behalf of Vishwa Hindu Parishad and Bajrang Dal in front of Home Minister Anil Deshmukh's residence in Nagpur. The protesters had said that Home Minister Anil Deshmukh objected of saying Jai Shri Ram. He should apologize for this. The protesters chanted Jai Shri Ram, Jai Shri Ram in front of Deshmukh's residence. Also read Hanuman Chalisa. As soon as the news of the movement came to know, the police administration sent the team and arrested the activist. With the positive response of the citizens to the two days janta curfew now it is expected that the administration should once again discuss the decision of the city's lockdown after the two days of janta curfew when the public came on the streets on monday the same crowd was there but the city's most crowded sitabadi was deserted the shops looked empty shopkeepers were looking for customers this all shows that the citizens are still following the guideline given by the administration A man resident of Besa Road in Manewada killed his wife and her lover with an axe. Ajni police have arrested the accused and both the dead bodies have been sent to medical for post-mortem. Police presented the accused in court after which the court sent him for 7 days remand. According to the information the accused is from Balaghat. He has been living in Nagpur for a long time and is working as a laborer. The name of the accused is Kunawar Lal Parmia. Due to the extramarital relationship between his friend and wife, the matter of killing has kept to light. Ajni police registered a case and presented the accused in the court, after which the court sent the accused on 7 days remand. Mayor Sandeep Joshi and all the MLAs of BJP visited the medical Mayo Ames Hospital on Monday to know arrangement of all departments. Corona infection is increasing in the city, in which many speculations are being made about the medical system of the city. It is also being said that the hospital has a fewer beds at the Corona Hospital. Amid such speculation, Mayor Sandeep Joshi and all BJP MLAs looked over it. At this time, MLAs Anil Sole, Girish Vyas, Vikas Kumbare, and Pravin Dutke were present. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more updates and news of in and around the city, please stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnakar says goodbye. Please do take care of yourself.